what did max say um he was just being disrespectful he reacted to the video and he was just saying a lot of unnecessary comments and trying to be funny and disrespectful um just sexual me the entire time and trying to be weird okay so let's look at it like this okay let's look at it like this lady starts only fans no 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 oops my bad gets exposed for sucking is upset that she got exposed for sucking starts only fans now i get not being like wanting to be sexualized but you sexualize yourself so what are we talking about you got your you got leaked for sucking yeah. so um yeah you know and the leak fucked up you shouldn't leak people that's fucked up but then you start an OnlyFans, so you know it is what it is. Maya, it's no hard feelings, you know. I was just around in the bit. I don't got no hard feelings towards Maya at all. I really don't know why we still talking about this, man. But you know, I was begged to make this video, so yeah, I'm not gonna go over her whole history like I did last time. But y'all know who Maya Buckus is, and if you don't, this was a female in the underground about two years ago that got leaked. Yeah, she that's that's really what she was known for. Literally, she made an Asian rock song, and then after that, then you seen a video get exposed out of nowhere of her doing her thing with one of her boyfriends from a long time ago, and that's what she pretty much known for. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of crazy to say that, but I don't know another way to put it. Of course, people have moved on, but. That that is her representation. And the only reason why she still has a teeny bit of buzz behind her name is because after that whole scenario of her getting leaked and all that, she started doing interviews and talking to a lot of streamers and stuff. And she was on these E-Days and these YouTuber videos and stuff. It was just kind of crazy. But recently, she kind of did something where she had a whole altercation with Five Star. Like, if you go on Twitter, you will see that they was just going back and forth all day. And I know y'all probably wonder, okay, what was the reason behind it? So Maya Buck has seen a video from two years ago that was going around on TikTok of her being on stream with Max and talking about the video that went around of her doing her thing with her ex-boyfriend or something and the clip was kind of funny because of the way how max reacted when they was talking about it and stuff like that they keep spamming like throat goat they keep spamming twitter in my chat what is that about a video of me i got leaked oh for real yeah is it still public Hello? And we all know that Max has a lot of plugs. So whatever happened two years ago, three years ago, it might be posted on TikTok and he doesn't control that. Those are his plug channels. They get clips from any time. They're just promoting him. They're posting clips. You know what I'm saying? Like any other plug channel would do. But that's the thing. After two years, Maya didn't like the fact that this clip was posted again. And she went on her story and she typed up a full paragraph basically saying, not gonna lie, this shit is weird and lame. I feel uncomfortable as f doing this, but anything to get a clip is more important than morals. And when you first see this, you be like, okay, she's mad at Max? Uh, the clip was posted from a plug channel though. Of course that clip was posted a day ago, but, but that video or that stream that she talking about, that was from two years ago. And trust me, I don't know what intention she had when she posted that story, but it almost seemed like you trying to make Max look like a weirdo or something like But that. you know, Five Star wasn't having that. They literally seen that story. Now people on Twitter were confused to why Maya would post it and say this now. Why are you saying this after two years? The video been out there. Yeah, that clip got posted, but that video been out there. And Tay has something to say about this. He said, there's just no way you talking about max morals my buckets when you did only fans and quit bro has zero problems with you plus the clip is two years old let it go and y'all know how tay is man they they went back and forth and stuff man and maya said i never did only fans and the clip is two years old but still getting posted and viral to this day if you want to try and defend your faith at least know what the f you talking about and tay said max is my bro so i think i know what i'm talking about here but there's no actual way you calling him weird because of your actions just take accountability and let the past be the past you got leaked and sloppy who cares you're the only one still on this shit. so it's my fault someone took and leaked the video of me without my consent copy <laughs> laughing emoji i'm done arguing with y'all but tay said 100 not your fault but you chose the wrong nigga to put your trust in that's you though all i'm saying is that niggas don't care no more plus max don't got shit to do with that he was just trolling like everyone else would which doesn't make that weird but somebody else responded he said it's the internet obviously people are going to reuse old clips to get interaction you acting like max still be talking about you or something you just begging for attention at this point maya said how am i begging for attention by saying that shit is weird there's multiple vids of him reacting to me like i said if you don't understand what i'm talking about then don't say nothing and i know what she talking about but those videos are still old so maya what even nor has something to say he said this shit was forever ago just chillax your leaks was already made they still up to you could have taken them down but you ain't next stop fiending for attention from max because his ass is crazy right now that shit was forever ago stop talking about morals yo ass had only OnlyFans and quit it respect max name and it was dudes in the comments actually showing proof that she had a fan fix not only fans but i don't know if it's the same thing or not i don't know and then amaya went on her story again she said if you in my dms arguing with yourself and defending somebody that don't know you please unfollow me laugh anymore and trust me i'm not one of those people to choose sides and stuff like that everybody know i don't do that but i can acknowledge that she's mad at the wrong people max is cool bro he didn't do anything wrong bro he just reacting like anybody else 
what? Even if it was weird, I don't think any other female would do what you did. Now, I get it. You should be able to speak your mind and speak your truth. But the truth is that you got leaked, Maya. You went on them streams. You went on them e-dates and stuff. And you went on Mac stream. And you weren't uncomfortable at that time. But after two years, now you're uncomfortable. Now you're saying something. I still don't see the biggest point of posting something like this because there's going to be engagement. You know people are going to see this. And it only look like you're just looking for attention. And I swear this doesn't make sense because if you were uncomfortable, right? Why did you, why did you create a fan fix after that? You don't have a problem with making money and promoting your body on fan fix, but you have a problem with this video. You have a problem with a two-year-old clip. Now, I think it's been like seven months or six months since I made that video a long time ago, but even after a month, nobody was talking about Maya. Like, nobody. And if there's any females watching this video, how do y'all feel about this? You know what I'm saying? Because are we in a wrong? You know what I'm saying? Or is it just the internet? Because it doesn't make sense, Maya. Like, that's how you branded yourself, gang. And not trying to be funny, Maya, but I think I looked up your name on YouTube one time and I'm seeing you getting, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just leave it on the screen, bro. You see this, bro? Like, you get what I'm saying, bro? Like, the last thing to be mad about, bro, is this. Like, come on, game. Like, you probably not gonna like this, but I'm gonna tell you right now. If you don't like people talking about this, don't be on the internet, game. Just don't. Because thank God it's been two years. You know what I'm saying? See, if that clip wasn't old, I will understand where you're coming from. But after two years, that story post you made was kind of unnecessary, game. But this video wasn't to bash my or nothing like that. I'm just speaking my mind. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want to speak about this, but I was I was begged to make this video. But it's D-U-T-I-E. I'm not sitting myself for no bitch. Don't forget to follow my kick and my IG right now, but I love y'all so much. Y'all stay blessed. Peace.